Morning, everyone. I am back here in my car. It's dark out, so the light is interesting. But I want to share what I think is a very important message right now. Um, it may be for you. I hope it is. Um, right now, many of us are being confronted with really intense, unconscious thoughts and behaviors. These are thoughts and behaviors that we're very familiar with that we just play out. Like uh, somehow you sabotage, sabotage relationships because in the subconscious mind, you're always trying to make sure you don't get hurt. So you leave early or you create scenarios where maybe they're cheating on you or lying on, lying to you, whatever. And then you the end, relationship ends, right? Or you get a really great job, but un, subconsciously you believe that you're never going to really be able to make it or they're going to fire you at some point. So you sabotage unconsciously and you end up having to find another job these are just two examples of how the unconscious mind through thoughts and behaviors sabotage our life and so what's happening right now is this these very subconscious thoughts and behaviors are appearing really loudly right now you're seeing yourself play them out once again but this time you know you don't want to sabotage you don't want to do it the same way you've been doing it over and over and over again maybe for years maybe for 30 40 years and so this is the opportunity what we are being asked by ourselves to do is that we have to do this differently and doing it differently is extremely difficult when you're conscious because now you've got all of these unconscious, ingrained thoughts stemming from a past, okay, telling you you're not going to be able to be successful in this job, you're not going to be happy, you might as well go find another one, you're going to get fired, or this relationship is too good, I feel like I'm not good enough, they're going to probably find somebody else, or I need to make sure that the other shoe doesn't drop first, so I have to have one foot in and one foot out. These are all ways in which we sabotage really incredible things, and it is tricky right now. So, First of all, just start paying attention to when these very comfortable subconscious thoughts and behaviors come in. And it's almost like you, you almost want to believe it. Well, no, they're going to cheat on me. So I'm going to find ways to make sure I don't get hurt. So I'll find out first. Or no, I know I'm not going to be able to be successful in this company. They already have it out for me. We believe the subconscious. We believe the, uh, the limiting thoughts. And then we do the behaviors. We are arguing for it, right? It's a defense mechanism. This is how we defend ourselves against any pain that we have had in the past, okay? But it's not true now. It's not true in this situation. It's only true in this situation because you're believing it to be true from a past experience. And so now you have to flip the script and you have to do it 180 degrees differently, and here comes the most challenging, fearful, courageous moment is that now you have to run into the fire. You have to stand vulnerable. You have to be okay with getting hurt. You have to be okay with not knowing. You have to be okay with a free fall. You have to be okay with saying, this is the biggest hurt in my life that I will be abandoned or that I will give my faith and trust over to this company or to this business or to this person and they're going to use me. They're going to take advantage of me. They're going to rip my heart out. You have no other choice right now if you want to move forward in your evolution and the shift in consciousness to do it differently. So if you're in a relationship and you're having a hard time trusting or you're doing the same old behaviors, you've got to sit back and say, I have to trust this person 100% no matter what. That's the gift. And then feel the fear, the nauseousness, how scared you may be, right? And you just have to keep moving forward through that fear. If you're in a job and you're like, oh my God, they're going to come after me. I should just leave. I'm not going to be able to get this. The, I'm not going to be able to you know, move up in this job. Or I'm trying to start a job. I'm not good enough. I should just quit. It's never going to happen. You just keep going through the motions, you keep pushing forward towards the goal of creating your own business, 
We have to literally fight against, go against the very natural, programmed, unconscious thoughts and behaviors that have been inside of us creating our world for a very long time. Do it differently. And you're going to say, well, this has been happening for a while. Of course, because the subconscious doesn't just go away. It's going to keep rearing its ugly head. And at some point, you're going to realize what this game is all about. And that you have to confront these subconscious thoughts and behaviors for, at the, from, the, from the ground where they were like anchored in, cemented in. And you have to break the cement and throw it out and say, I will courageously choose to get my heart broken over sabotaging something that could be the greatest thing in my life. Practice this. I love you.